Hey, what's up guys? I'm Lana here. Welcome to today's video. We're checking out a mood. Mood. What? We're checking a mod called Working La Buero High School. You got that right, boys and girls. This is a high school mod made by Nova Knives, and it looks pretty goddamn cool. It's like a working high, as, as close as we're going to get for a working high school, and it looks pretty goddamn cool. I'm very excited. Uh, this is great. As always, guys, if you enjoyed this video and you were impressed, make sure you leave a like, click that share button, all the good stuff does help my channel grow. Now, first things first, this is a pretty rough high school. As you can see, it's located next to these kind of like gangster area, as just give you the map overview kind of thing all the way down here it's pretty much like gangsters and stuff and obviously down here is grove street so the high school is pretty close to the kind of like gangster area so probably not the best high school in the world but hey that is pretty goddamn cool still that there's a mod here like this i mean this image on its own i think describes this high school perfectly <laughs> there's a cop car just outside it it pretty much picks them off you know school finishes they go back to jail so that's how it works. A couple of cars here, which are pretty cool. You know, people arriving here, maybe teachers and all that good stuff. So that's pretty nice. Over here, we have a little bit of a details outside the high school. There's not honestly too much details outside, but it's enough to make this look pretty cool. So there's a couple of people here. I don't know what this guy's doing. Uh, looks like there's a, the police. This is, actually, this is the police officer here. Talking to one of these guys, I guess. I don't know. Interrogating him. And it looks like there's some kind of course here for this golf buggy. So I don't know why. Like if we zoom out, for example, you can see that it's like a little bit of a course going on here. So he has to kind of like, you know, go through the cones and make sure he passes i don't really know kind of cool still over here it's a three and three basketball game that break gonna about to break out which is pretty cool i like it that's a really nice touch i mean this is literally the game is just about to either begin or it's finished so very very cool there down here we've got a couple details here like you know little things like bikes added for example which i think is quite cool we've got two girls talking about probably boy problems like oh my god jessica i'm gonna do my best girl impression are you ready oh my god jessica Jessica Brad just totally like fucked me in the ass. So that pretty much escalated quickly there, but yeah, I mean, look at this bitch's face. She's like, mm, yeah, I love those boys. Oh, god damn. She doesn't look like she's in high school. I mean, she looks like she's like uh, in college. Actually, what's the age there in high school? What What's like the age you, you, in America? You're in high school. I don't really know. But swiftly, we're going to move on at the other end of the school, which has got a little bit of a skate park. We have a couple of dudes here, which is pretty nice. Uh, some kind of skaters, and this guy's filming something here, but there's no one really skating around this area. So I think adding maybe a guy on top of here would be a nice touch like you know he's about to drop in and do a mad trick i think that'd be quite a nice little feature you know adds a little bit more realism i suppose oh shit oh shit look what i just found i kind of heard a guy make some noise right and for some reason he's like under the ramp so exactly what i said is here but it's like under the ramp for some reason or in the ramp which is a little bit weird that's strange but hey it the guy actually was going to do that. So that's a pretty cool thing, right? But it just kind of glitched out a little bit it's in the ramp, which I thought was a little bit strange. So there's two entrances to the school, as you can see, this one and the front one. We'll just go through the front, uh, you know, check it all out. So here we go, Atlantic is going back to school. Uh, gonna do my GCSEs and fail everything. All right, so let's uh go kapuya real simple it goes in and out really really cool i love the details here as well and it's really smooth for example look i can go out here i'm back out at the front and it's just like this right which is awesome i love how quick it is you can seriously have some you know role playing stuff with this or just having fun with this which is awesome so let's explore this area right so this is technically the door that we come in that's the door that we entered right over here we can see a couple of the lockers and there's some guys here you know checking stuff out i mean they're a little bit old to be in high school i feel like but uh we'll kind of like breeze through through that right because i mean there's no real age thing for the characters you can't really have like children in game and stuff like that so uh, it's understandable right so there's older guys meant to be the students here so it doesn't really matter but i like this there's a little bit of detail in the lockers or for example he's opened it and there's like a shirt in there looks like his little packed lunch which is pretty cute so that's all nice and dandy over through here it looks like this is the janitor's closet where you probably never want to enter because you know janitor's closet was always like uh i'm kind of fucking scared to go in there because every school has the most creepiest janitor ever. They're always like, hey kids, uh, watch out what you're doing. And they always got a little crazy eye. Like, she's kind of scared. Or, there's a crazy big butch lady. Alright, she, she looks like she could literally suplex city Brock Lesnar style. Big ass butch lady. One of the two. There's no in between of anything else. So we can go upstairs. Uh, we'll check that out afterwards. Let's check out the rooms first. So going down the hallway, got more lockers, which is pretty goddamn cool. Down here, look at this. There's another girl uh, in the lockers, and there's a girl here as well in the lockers looking at the map, maybe. I don't know if she's going on a fucking field trip or something. Who knows? 100 tips for improving self-esteem. I guess 
I guess she's trying, right? A couple dudes here just chilling, waiting for the class to start. You got your typical vending machines, uh, which is pretty goddamn cool. Back in my school, we didn't really have these snack things, actually. You weren't, like, allowed to get them. So we used to go like, all the way out to the place that they had them and spend all of our lunch money on these, like, sweet machines. So here is the room number Unos. And uh, this looks like the IT class, by the looks of things. We got uh, pretty cool. I mean, look at this. There's like a table here. It seats two kids uh, or students. So there's four of them. So that's pretty goddamn cool. You know, you can have eight kids here doing some IT shit, which is really nice. Look at this. Details everywhere. Like these monitors, injectors up here. Wide board. This is really, really cool. I am actually really impressed with this. High school mod is awesome. The next room is over this way. And this looks like a bigger classroom. This... I don't know what class this could be. This could be anything, right? Because it just looks like a classroom with the desks and chairs. This is surprisingly, amazingly well done. A great detail. Very believable mod. I don't know. This looks like maybe some kind of presentation or something. This could be anything, right? Because it looks like they're doing some kind of presentation on their maybe project or something. Really, really damn cool. So let's head upstairs before we go outside to, you know, the other side. Hello from the other side. I must have farted a thousand times. So upstairs, looks like this is the cafeteria area, which is pretty goddamn cool. You get your little shitty tray, and you got your dinner man and dinner lady. Look at this. You get, all you're going to get is burgers. Uh, she actually got the baguette. Very nice. This guy's got a burger and then another burger. Oh, oh shit. We're about to throw down. Oh, we got a fight. We have a high school fight going. Oh, I'm about to whip my ass. Whip, whip this boy's ass. The, the, this is when the bully picks on me. You know, I got to beat him up. Got to show my authority. Otherwise, all the kids will think I'm a punk. And then they're going to be like, take my lunch money. So you knock him out. And now you're the champ. I am the WWE. Oh, I just knocked. Oh, I'm so sorry. Oh, shit. I'm so sorry. Look, I don't want to fight you. But I will punch a girl in the throat, okay? Look at her. Oh my god, she's fucking creepy as fuck. That's it. I'll beat your ass up. There we go. Get good night. Sleep with the fishes. So this is pretty cool. Upstairs is a canteen, which is a huge canteen space. You know, probably could seat maybe like, I don't know, 50 people or so. Probably not 50. A little bit less than that. But uh, pretty goddamn cool. I like this. So that's kind of it for the classrooms. It's not very big, but, the, you know, it's kind of like a mod. It's still in baby steps. It's like the first version. And I think this is brilliant. Loads of details like this janitor here, there's security here. You can exit the class for this area as well. So if you go down here, you come at the back of it. And if you go back in, you're at this area. So this is pretty cool. One thing I wanted to show you how crazy this is, is where this is located. This is the power of mods. This is at the airport. Look at this. The actual classroom is located at the airport. So you look, you can fly through this and this is the classroom. How immersive is that, right? Technically, what I'm doing now is really not immersive because I'm showing you what it is, right? But think of the reason, think of how it looks inside and you're like, holy shit, this is so cool. I think I'm in the classroom, but you're not. You're like the airport and it's a custom build. It's just really cool. I don't know if anybody else really cares about it. I find this mega fucking cool. But as always, guys, hopefully you enjoyed this mod. If you did, make sure you leave a like, click that share button. All the good stuff does help my channel grow. And this is really cool. Honestly, really, really, really detailed mod. Has some great features. What the fuck? Did this guy just teleport or did... What? I uh, What? That was weird, dude. Are you like Harry Potter or something? What? He's just... What? What the fuck? Dude, look at this guy. What the fuck? <gasps> what the fuck? Why did they do that? That's so creepy. That is real creepy. All right, guys. So hopefully you enjoyed. If you did, leave a like, click that share. All the good stuff does help my channel grow. Before we go, though, I guess let's get rid of it and see what goes. You know, most of the things we're not going to see will actually disappear, but, uh, you know, why the hell not? One, two, three, and kapuya. There she goes. Pretty goddamn cool. I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching, and bye.